Well, organize, agitate, educate. That charge from Susan B. Anthony was echoed during an inspirational event in honor of the iconic women's rights leader. I had the honor of serving as MC tonight as hundreds gathered at the convention center to celebrate Susan B. Anthony's birthday. In her travels, Susan B. Anthony left behind tracks of change. Local and state elected leaders joined some 600 supporters of Susan B. Anthony for a birthday celebration in honor of the voting rights and human rights advocate. The event served as a fundraiser to expand the home and museum on Madison Street because the CEO of the Anthony House, Deborah Hughes, explains they've actually had to turn away visitors due to demand. A new $25 million project is expected to help accommodate more visitors and provide more room to display the extensive Susan B. Anthony collection. In addition to collector's items, t-shirts, and other merchandise, event goers had the opportunity to purchase the book Overground Railroad tonight. The author, Candace Taylor, served as the keynote speaker. It's easy to get lost in the history books and say, you know, this is what was and let's celebrate that and the nostalgia factor is really you know, seductive, but at the same time, it's really important to, um, to figure out what it is people can learn from what you see and actually implement some kind of change, and I think that's what Susan B. Anthony was always doing. In her book, Taylor tells the story of how Victor Green created a guide for black people at a time when driving while black could truly be a death sentence, as travelers had little to no access to lodging, food, and gas while on the road simply because of racism. People of all races are hungry for this history. Part of her message tonight, to encourage people in the same manner that Susan B. Anthony did by challenging people to find the one thing you can do to make a difference in your community. I want people to believe in the possibility of change and not just say that we're going to change things, but if you believe in that possibility, then you can think of ways to really impact and connect with people to provide some kind of solution.